We are here in the ghetto of Venice, the most ancient ghetto of Europe. The name ghetto comes after the wrong pronunciation of the name, the real name of the area, which was to use to be the ghetto, the metal foundry area. In the early Middle Ages, in fact, this area was used as a metal foundry, used to cast the cannons for Venetian ships. The original foundry alley was in the other square, then the foundry was moved here to be moved definitely in 1390 in the arsenal. When the Jews arrived here, they were German-speaking Jews, so they transformed ghetto into a hard uh, G ghetto. If this area, instead of having a metal foundry, had a bakery, a pistol in Venetian language, now we should have pistols around the world, not ghettos. When uh, the Jews arrived, the first inhabitants in the area where we are, the area of the new foundry, the new ghetto, as they called it. So, despite the name, new ghetto is the most ancient Jewish, Jewish, Jewish part, to which the old ghetto follows in 50, 1541, and the newest ghetto, which was not part of the foundry, in 1633. The safe conduct uh, for the Jews uh, and the beginning of the ghetto was on the 29th of March, 1516 and the ghetto ended officially with the arrival of Napoleon and the very end of the Republic of Venice in 1797. Not to open again. This ghetto, in fact, was not used during World War II, and it's the only Jewish area of Europe which was used as a ghetto during the war.